Hi. <clears throat> well, my back hurts, so I'm sitting, and he is going to start the apple pie situation. Okay. As you all know, we read the manual from cover to cover before even looking at the rest of the box. Okay, so you can watch while he reads the manual from cover to cover. Okay. Oops, it's over on the freezer. I read it. something. Don't worry, I know exactly how to use these. You do? Do you have one? I am the manual. You're the manual man. I think this goes the other direction. Nope, I got this. Okay, I understand now. Z. This must go like this. And I put this in here. You just figure out which way it goes. No. Oh yeah, that's right. It goes on like that. Something like that. That's right. Yeah, I thought the hard is it. And then you stick it on the table. But this table might not stick very well because it's... This doesn't make any sense. It works. You have to take off the blades. Oh, now I see. It's and this goes pointy. like that first. Now get your apple and stick it on there. Where is my apple? They're in the apple bag over there. Oh, over here. Over here, over there. We have an obstacle. We have no obstacles. There is a plastic barrier between me and apples. No, not the plastic barrier! This apple looks good. I can't go wash it. I can't stand the medicine or taking the pills off. So I'm going to do something bad. See? Which way should I? I'm just going to stick it. It doesn't matter. No. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oops, wait. We're not looking at it. Okay, now. Okay. That's incredible. Okay. Now what? Guess we put it down? It's coming. No, it's coming. That's your fingers. Interesting. Isn't that cool? Oh my. No, wait, no, wait. Don't take it yet. Now you pull this up. Come on, that's supposed to be on top, and you push it down. <laughs> he made so much fun of me. I'm not going to do that. I'm pulling this knife toward myself. I'm going to do this, this. Yeah, see, there you go. This. See, that side's actually sharp. <laughs> yep, and this side's actually sharp. Watch your fingers, Mom. Down we go. <clears throat> this is a man who bench presses 195 pounds. <clears throat> Open for the <clears throat> Okay, there we go. Quick, we need a pot for the apples. Oh. Okay, can you no. give me that yeah, clear bowl, Dan? Eh? Keep Bring your that. apple. Fever. We need that bowl over there in the corner. The, the, oh, the clear one. Yeah, that's the glass. Wait, one. wait. Wait, wait, wait. This is going to be proper cool. Mm. It's going to be big. I mean, one more time. That is so cool. And now, put your fingers, children. Can I have a piece of the pie? No, it's not for today. It's for tomorrow. Well, then why would you keep calling me? Which how did you didn't know how we did it? Well, you didn't tell me you Mom, made it. Get your fingers out of there. Perfect, perfect. See, perfect. if your fingers had them in there, they would be bruised. They would be terribly bruised. I can pull this off. This goes in the, um... You might as well bring the whole bag over. You know, there was this guy on, like, BBC who eats apple peels and throws up the apple bits. He's crazy, but he's a faster person. He's a what? He fasts. No, he doesn't fast. Hey, that's he's not on, right? Oh, no, it was on wrong. Oh, 
whatever you say. You know what? What? Engineers are my best friends. Engineers? They make cool things for me. Cut your fingers again. Cut your fingers. Just, just you don't have to sit and hold it. Just, just this. These are not, these are leaving a little bit of stuff at the end. This is a terrible disaster. You know? Don't worry. Well, it cleans my fingernails anyway. We can use a knife. A knife, a knife. See, see what I did there? It's clever, isn't it? Mmm. I have to go down to the bottom right. We can use a knife. They können Herbruch machen von ein Mess. They können Gebruik machen von ein Mess. They können Gebruik machen von ein Mess. They können Gebruik machen von ein Mess. Machen von ein Mess. We können Gebruik machen von ein Mess. Okay, I'm going to just say use a knife. In mess. In mess. See, isn't this faster and more fun? It's lazy when it gets to the very top. Do it again, see if it does better. No, because this part comes out anyways. See? Okay. Uh -oh. Don't hold it, Mom. I'm just pressing down. I'm afraid I'm going to break it though, like this plastic bit. Yeah. Chapels is no. Oh, we can make more. Couple more. Mm hmm. We are cutting apples. They schneiden apples. They schneiden apples. They snide in apples. They snide in apples. We are cutting apples. They snide in apples. They snide in apples. We snide in apples. Are you sure that the blade is going is on the right side there? The snide in apples. The we snide in apples. We snide in apples. The snide in apples. We snide in apples. We snide in apples. They snide in apples for apple tart. They snide in apples for apple tart. They snide in apples for apple tart. Lecker apple tart. Apple 
appeltaart. Hoor je wel een appeltaart? Oké. Okay. Oké, okay. now we have to make it sweet. Wait, we didn't clean those. Chemicals. Those chemicals. chemicals will give you give you Parkinson's disease. Ah, uh, cool. You could hang them up though. Yeah, you can make baskets out of them. Like this part. You can make a basket. No, whatever. Go. I'm gonna make a basket out of it. Cause I'm a basket maker. Time and a place, mother. Time and a place. We're on a mission. I know. There's no time for. For making baskets. There's always time for making baskets, Daniel. These are very long. They make good weavers. Your basket will be killed by root flies. Nah, it'll dry. It'll be, it'll dry and get skinny. <clears throat> this is going to be an awesome, awesome basket. What do I add to my apple bits? Okay, now we have to spice it up. Okay. So you want to look it up in the book? Where's nope. the book? I will tell What's you. Like, What's that like? Two spoons of cinnamon. What? Two teaspoons of cinnamon. Well, first you take That's your, nutmeg. get a bowl. Get a little bowl. Get a little bowl. Okay. And we'll look up apple pie. Okay. Is a little in a bowl? Mm, no. Get a bigger bowl. Apple pie. P-I-E. 651. Okay. Okay. Uh, you have a pie. liter of bowl. Okay, you need... White or brown sugar, salt, cornstarch, cinnamon, nutmeg. Okay? So. Okay. Ow! Okay. So we need um, a half to two thirds of a cup of white or brown sugar. So you can put our. Luckily, our this sugar has free, on it. Our sugar free stuff on there. Well, um, the mission is four off. Well, it's a two-cup measuring cup, isn't it? How much do we need? Let me see. We need one and a half cups of sugar. Oh, no, a minutes. half a cup of sugar for five to six apples. Oh, the other one's open. The other one's up high in that cup. Of... That was very well done, so it didn't fall everywhere. Yeah. These are going to be this is an awesome basket, you know. The brownness of her apples is in jeopardy. What'd she do? She plays apple skins in front of it. Oh no, this is one third of a cup. Well, what did it say? Well, you know what? what? One third plus half a third is. Three six, so I'm just gonna do that. Which is a half a cup. Yeah. That's my math. Taught me fractions for a reason in school. Oh, that's right. Okay, now you need an eighth of a teaspoon of salt. An eighth of a teaspoon of salt. Yeah, remember we measured a quarter teaspoon in your hand already. <sighs> okay, give me the, the salt. Where it's you? over on the stove. I remember how big it was. It was like it was like this big or something. Yeah, here, use half of this. Oh my god, this. There, eight. Okay. And then you need to put in there one to one and a half tablespoons of cornstarch. Cornstarch. It's back up in the cupboard. The corn. Same one. This one? Uh-huh. Top shelf. One to one and a half tablespoons. Yeah. I like I like cornstarch. I'm gonna put one and a half. Or I'll just put a heaping tablespoon in. It's a pretty heaping tablespoon.
whatever. Okay. Chop that. Okay, then it wants um, cinnamon and nutmeg. Cinnamon and nutmeg. They're going to be in the top drawer over there under the microwave. Uh oh. That drawer is pretty crazy. It is. Teaspoon. I mean, cinnamon and nutmeg. Cinnamon. You don't want to let go. No, I wouldn't let go of where you either. Something's wrong with this. Cinnamon, nutmeg, garam masala, and cloves. Let's close the mold cupboard. What? What? I'm going to move this over here. I said nothing. The lineup for dinner. You said what? Did Ooh. you miss with that? I did. Okay. You can put it back in. No, it's, it doesn't matter. Teaspoon, tablespoon, how much cinnamon? Mm, well, I don't know. Put in this much. Yeah, that's good. And some nutmeg. Where's nutmeg made of? Come out of a nutmeg. A nutmeg is a ball that grows on a tree. Ooh. You, yeah, just a little bit of that compared to the rest. And then. Mix her up. Now how do we do this? Do we have to cook it because it's, it's got... Yeah, but it's going to be baked, right? The apple pie is going to get baked. We have to make our pie crust. I know. But the pie crust is going to be, it's going to be cooked in the pie crust. We don't have to, we have to cook put it in a pie, pie pan. I mean, I know, but we'll put the pie crust in, and then put this in after. So we'll get the pie crust ready. We will, but you can go ahead and mix this in. So now we are ready for our pie crust. Yep, 
We don't have that much pipe rust. Not for this. Good day, though. Okay. can make it in here then. Because we have to put it on top too, right? Okay, so now, do you remember how to make a pie crust? Yeah, we need more flour. That's good enough. Okay, how do you start? Like this. Okay. And we go ahead and take too much pie crust, like all of it. No, you need to leave some for the top, which will be less than you use for the bottom. Oh, but this is good for the Yeah, bottom. that's good. Am I patting it too much? No. Flatten it. I'll mess around. Then go from the middle out. Turn it over. Look at me for round. Alright. Something. I'm oh, sorry. You need a little more flour, like you said before. Well, let's get some more flour. There we go, that's good. And don't push too hard. Okay, that's good. And now you can roll it up and we set it on here, which is, you really could be using a bigger pie pan. If you want. What? If you want. I don't have bigger ones, I don't think. And don't don't cut the edge off yet. Oh, we were also supposed to add a little lemon juice, weren't it, weren't we? Fork? No. Cook it first. So you don't have to no, you don't cook it first. Oh. But we could cut these into smaller pieces, okay. I think. No, you don't have to do that. Oh. very tart apples. Granny Smith's even. So we don't have to have lemon juice because they're tart. That's right. Okay. We're going to have enough for two pies. Okay, we're going to cut off these edges, don't we? Not yet. Okay, now you need to make another pie crust. Flour. Okay. 
not going to have enough, Mom. You don't have to have a big pile for this. You only have to go a small amount. But you're right, we won't. So we'll make only one pie. With lots of apples in it. Is anyone going to work? Yep. Okay, well then. Get the rest of this. going to be a deep dish apple pie. Sure will. Put the top on. Same way. Oh, but first, now we need to wet the edge of the pie crust. Wait, I want to we have to dampen more. this. Oh. Okay. Okay. So use cold water and and wet it all the way around the edge. Now you're going to press it down so it pinches into the other one and it'll stick. Okay, and then you can take a knife and cut it off the sides. Do that. <coughs> okay, now then you have to poke the top. Yeah, but first we're going to take egg whites and we're going to put egg whites on it. I'm going to make an egg white, guys. Observe the art. I'll be coming with the rule by being over right here. Which one's the egg white? This one? Doesn't matter. I'm 
put this one for the egg white. Okay, that's it. You don't want to take a chance of breaking it. Bloop. Okay, then you take a fork and you whip it with a fork. so that it's cut. You're cutting it all the way over so that it's not going to stick together. Okay, it's pretty good. Getting the Okay. Get it all wet. And then now you can draw one. a little design on top if you wish. I wish. You can make like a little, little mouth and a little eyes. You can make a little... Or a butterfly. Don't cut it all the way through, but just prick it. Is this going to be like pi r squared? Okay, that's it. There we go. Is that a Chinese thing? It's pi. Pi. <laughs> oh yeah, that's because it is a pi. Oh, you're so funny. I guess it does need to cut all the way through. Because we're going to let it steam it out. We forgot to put butter in there. Well, okay, so now into the oven it goes. and on Not the before adding a chicken breast. Yeah, that's right. We forgot Do we sprinkle that. sprinkle cinnamon on it or something? Usually you put sugar on it. Can we put real sugar on it? No. Ha. Huh. I don't know if it'll taste right with the other stuff on it. But maybe we can do that. We can sprinkle this stuff on it. We're going all the way. What? And no one will be the wiser. Yeah. I hope no cranky chefs. Okay, so Look. now... Um, we forgot to put the Blue the butter inside. I think that might matter. We can't undo it. We're gonna have to undo it just here on the pie. I'm just gonna open pie a little bit, okay? It's okay. It's okay. It's kind of a thick pastry. We'll just stick that in there. Okay, it'll go everywhere. <laughs> That's our pie hole. Um, okay, now wait a minute. Place them in layers in the pie shell, dot with butter. If the apples are bland, then sprinkle with lemon juice. If you are serving the pie with cheese, omit the 
uh, flavors and use fennel or anise. Should the apples be very dry, add water or cream. Cover the pie with a pricked upper crust. Bake in 450 for 10 minutes. You may prick it. I'm going to need to go up to 450. Been all pricked. That's not. Otherwise, all the juices are gonna go on the floor. Okay, and then it goes in there for 450. Mm -hmm. Hot yet? It is hot. Enough. There we go. Look, we've got egg whites there at the bottom. That should be fine. That should. It'll smell her up. In we go. I'm going to take a pan and put a pan underneath the whole works. In case it drips, okay? I'll put it on the bottom shelf under it. Okay. Now we'll cook it like that for 10 minutes. Then we'll turn the heat down to 350 and cook it for 35 to 45 minutes or until golden brown. For a delicious touch, sprinkle the top crust lightly with sugar and cinnamon as you put the pie into the oven. Some cooks brush it first with milk, others prefer to finish the pie off after baking with blah blah blah. Well, you heard it here about the egg whites. Okay, we'll keep you informed. Bye.